Do you want to see answers to prayer? I do too. Why? Don't answer yet. <laughs> Why? We want to see answers to prayer. Yeah, we do. Why? Do you want to see the Lord heal the sick and raise the dead? Yeah. yeah. But why? Do you want to see the lost saved, the backslider restored, the broken, desolate, mournful hearts rejoice? And all the people said yes. Yeah. But why? Most of all, do you pray, and a lot do, loudly and long and in significant and serious tones for revival you've got to say it the right way revival in wales right do, do you do that well why do you want to see that i remember hearing people for years as a young believer in a quite a lovely church uh, but hearing people you may have 270 280 people in a prayer meeting on a wednesday night and there'd be people there asking god to you know uh, pour out his spirit and to revive his work in the midst of the years now i never understood that phrase completely uh, it was normally there it was floating about you know revive your work in the midst of the years uh, where else was he going to do it I, I just didn't know but why do you want to see that why 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 jesus says this is not the path to blessing now of course we want to see the glory of god right we want to see the glory of God. We want to see Jesus glorified because glorious is what he is and we know that now. But it's not, says Jesus, the way to blessing to pin faith on seeing. And this episode where we've got what we've got and then the bit with Thomas and uh, takes, takes a, is a lump, is one lump together. The point is that is not the path to blessing. And that comes as something of a shock, doesn't it? seems just a bit hard to believe which shows just how far we can fall into thinking that seeing is believing and seeing is believing is one of the fundamental ideologies of broken discipleship broken discipleship says seeing is believing seeing is great no doubt seeing God glorify himself is great but what Jesus says to Thomas at the end of this, the stress at the end of it is laid on this. Blessed are those who have not seen and still have believed. What's that about? Blessed are those who take God at his word in the dark, says Jesus. Why is that? Because faith is taking God at his word and trusting him to live like you do take him at his word, whether you can see or not. 